Hey guys, Billy here from Verify6. I'm the filmer and editor, and a lot of, getting a lot of questions on my videos about how I got a few of them to HD, even though I don't shoot with an HD camcorder. It's actually really easy. I use Sony Vegas Pro 9. That's one of the easier programs. I'm not sure you can do it in like Movie Maker. I don't know Mac at all, so wait for Vegas to open up. <sighs> all right. New project. You're gonna want your file template to be. 720, 24 progressive. That's what most regular definition, standard definition camcorders shoot in. And we're going to put it into HD. It says HDV, but we're not using that. And full resolution right hand quality to best. Keep everything else the same. Close the pen. Explore. Um, and you also notice that we got the widescreen here. Instead of, uh, yeah, this is a normal template. You got ratio of 4 to 3, and with the widescreen 24 progressive, the widescreen here. And see your dimensions down there. Uh, let's see. Hard drive, scan clips. Uh, I don't know. Let's do Chris's K flip. That one in. I have never tried it. If anyone's wondering how to get slum out, whatever, I'll just put a slum on this real quick. Split your clip right there. Click S, split it when he's landing. Move that there, hold control, and drag the edge of the clip. Just a quick thing right there. Fade. Fade. Line up a little. If you don't want the echo on your slow mo, click lock the stretch, go to properties and the audio. As you can see here, we got the black le side letter boxing on the side. What we can do a couple things with that. I'm gonna show you the easiest things. You go to um, track motion. Drag this in. You can do one or two things. You can drag it all the way out like that. That's usually what I do. Drag it all the way out so there's no black anymore. Looks nice. Thing is, we're losing about two feet up there and two feet down there for footage, which you have to compensate for while you're filming. You have to remember if you're going to render in HD. And the other thing to do. So we're back with the letterbox. The other thing you can do is go back to track motion, lock aspect ratio, just drag it out sideways. This is not the best way to do it. As you can see, it kind of looks fat and looks like you should drag it out. I mean, like, it's not that bad but you don't lose any um, time.
top or bottom frame whatever for it so that's why I just like to uh, drag it out regularly without the stretch but uh, I'll show you how to render this drag that over go to render as we're not going to stand we're going to go back to default to Chris HD default main concept if you're ever uploading to YouTube or any website it is a good idea to use main concept and .mp4 because that's the favorite format for YouTube so we go into default now we're going to go to custom we're in default custom frame size we can leave it at that include video profile main leave it uh, you can change this depending on your settings film pal NTSC just change it to NTSC doesn't matter the pixel aspect ratio keep it one variable bitrate this is the main thing if you don't want like a choppy video change it to either 10 and 10 that's what I use 10 and 14 if you're not cared about how big the prod uh, project is I'm actually going to save this as HD sorry my O button doesn't work so <laughs> copy that HD YouTube, save the template. If you really want great quality, you can use two pass, which will make your quality amazing. Doesn't matter. Uh, format doesn't matter, then I'll change this. Click OK. Now you can see I have standard and HD YouTube. I'm going to click rendered loop region only because that's my loop region right there. And. I'm going to save it in my videos right here. Oops, not an end of summer. That's not what we want. Oh, Chris HD. Okay. I'm going to let this render. I'm going to upload it to YouTube and I'm going to show you the final product. And now the uh, video is just uploading to YouTube. Got another two minutes and then I'll check if it's done, check if the quality is HD already. Well, here it is in uh, HD, Chris HD test. I don't know why it's not loading or anything. Probably because I just uploaded it like 30 seconds ago. Give it another, let's see. Watching HD maybe? Hmm. There we go.